the next story. Now, a video of people carrying a makeshift church has created buzz in the interwebs. It's a common practice that normally happens in the village community to shift semi-permanent houses in the rural areas where the social cohesion is still intact. So this is the video um, which we have. I, at first, when, we, when you saw it, what did you think they were doing? What <laughs> 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 Oh, you know, actually when you can't pay the rent, so you, <laughs> you carry yeah, the house. Actually, it was a contractor who alishikanishi o kanisa, awajamulipa, kamwa. Acha tu ni bebe basi ile kitu naweza. Mimi, what came to my mind is former Nairobi governor, Ferdinand Waititu. <laughs> because riparian land nah, hey, now we are seeing that yeah. actually things you can could move. have moved the river yes instead of <laughs> in fact if you know that you're building a house in areas where the land in ownership is disputed build something like this mm. so that just in case yeah. <laughs> can you say yeah. <laughs> and actually they can they can put provision for wheels mm. so that sasa you push it like a cut you know, so like the wheel of God can be done. Yes, yes. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel. <laughs> yes, we'll be a break if I can. Ah, no. He is as a dio, like when I'm a crusade in a canisa. Like yeah. you're carrying the whole thing with you. Yeah, because so, I'm wondering, those are uh, like a uh, hundred people. I could not want to Sorry, a hundred, a hundred, a hundred what? A hundred persons. A uh, uh, hundred what? Persons. Men. A <laughs> hundred men. Thank yeah. you. No, they, yes. I, I saw yes. women there, so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there <laughs> were women. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, so they would have easily put wings life. on either side, both sides, Newman and Bello Askume. But you know. But now you see why they need a Prado, because now. <laughs> 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 because nobody else will be proud of you. <laughs> Hey, you guys have made me laugh today. You've been waiting to say ah. these jokes. But I, I don't understand. Um, so from construction, this was the plan that it no, can I, I think there are so many moved. places, especially in central Kenya, mm. where people build houses that can be relocated. Yes. Oh, I think oh, at the time of construction, they do not think about it as we will have to relocate it. But just in case we need to. And I was actually, when I was watching this video, the first thing I was thinking about is places like Wajia, Tana River, and all those places that flood, Akina uh, mm. Kano Plains mm -hmm. and Akina Budalangi. Th this, they should think about something like this. Mukiskia tu serikali imetangaza elino. Unahamisha, yeah. Anza kubeba nyumba enda. But sasa si ikikuja kabla usikia kile serikali imesema, wewe utamuka ujikuta unaenda na nyumba. Umekua nuhu. You are Noah. Somewhere in your ark. As for you and your house. And also there are those people who, you know, when they break up, maybe it's a family, then they break up, kila mtu kuna, maybe mzea lijenga nyumba, mama kanunua viti, you know, mkiwa chana, unabeba nyumba yako. Unachia mama viti kwa shamba. So they said it was a church. Mm. Oh, okay. So oh, it was geez. being moved to a new location. <laughs> I don't <laughs> understand. I'm so confused. I've never <laughs> even seen this. You're telling me it happens in Central. Mm. Where have you ever seen it? Plus, you know where I'm from? He's always just a Hamisha. You have to. Yeah, you have to. You have to. You have to. You have to. Yeah, maybe they, they thought that, uh, or rather, maybe. They are not coming to church though, so it's a classic example of taking the church to the people. Mm. So that now oh, they wali, wali wana, ne, ne, ya ulimwengu ya napita, lakini neno limesimama. They are bringing the church next to you. Nini yeah. mesema mwendi church. Watu, I saw someone the other day say people don't, uh, people are not going to church as much. Is that true, guys? Yeah. Yeah. yeah Why that, is that? That is very true. I think it's because. Continually, I don't know, but I think the culture of church going is not being passed generations and it started with the millennials that mm. they either chose they, because there are people who are raised in the church and still just chose to not go. And I think at some point it became fashionable to not go. You know, when we were being raised, it was the only choice available. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like, always if you want to Sunday, but you can't go Sunday school and you can't go to Yeah, there is a branch, branch, because you can't go to Sangha, because there are yes. so many different events to go for. There's a luta. Yes. Where are you going? Where are you And then there is Zile Zalimuru za Majani Chai. Yeah. There's so much. Band. Band. Yes. Yeah. But I think maybe for us, SDS, Sisi, wezi kosa kanisa Ukikosa utapigiwa na youth pastor Upigiwe na deacon, upigiwe na pastor Kukuliza maranatha Are you okay? Are you coming to church today? What is happening? So you seriously get several calls? 
They yeah. will know. Oh yeah, yeah, they'll know because we have brotherhood, sisterhood, accountability, yeah, accountability, accountability. uko wapi, sadaka mm. basi kama ukuji unaweza kuwekea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wacha mkono yako hivi. Sorry. I meant accountant, not accountability. Yeah. Accountant. <laughs> no, but also have you guys imagined at umehamia mahali there was no church next to where you were living. <laughs> and then we are We are bringing it closer. We are bringing the church closer yes. to you. Now yes. you have no excuse. Yes, <laughs> what? what is that? <laughs> and now you have to go because it's literally like uh, it's next door. It's next door. But please go. Let's let's pray. We need prayers. We need